all right hello you guys today is uh saturday <laughs> saturday i'll have to update you on my job and amazon so i'll get back to you guys in a different video but yeah let's just talk i wanted to talk to you guys about my finances um Today's only the 17th, but I feel like the end of the month is going to really come really fast. Monday's a holiday. That's the 19th. And I just feel like we got like 10 days after that. Uh, so, yeah, I just wanted to share with you my balances and my savings accounts. So for that rent one that I was mentioning, we have $810.63. Once again, I was just putting a little bit aside per month um to try to get this up to 900 950 dollars um just as a way of you know if hard times were to come about i could pay for my rent without any issues because that is the highest bill i have right um but you guys know i may be using this <laughs> um but i'll update you on some other things as well a lot of stuff has been going on oh my goodness so our savings so we have $4,300.07 in there. Um, that does include the $1,400 that we did save for June. So to get to my five k, we just have like $700 left remaining. But I feel like we won't get that done in the month of July. I feel like it will take us into the month of August to complete that. Um, because once again... <laughs> July is an expensive month uh, between uh, the credit card bills, having my um, six-month car insurance, which now includes my son, and me getting the key fob, as well as, um, you know, my son's stuff uh, for graduation, so, and eating out for graduation. So, yeah, I that's anticipated, but we'll be okay, but yeah, I think we'll complete the savings uh the savings of the 5k in august for the school loan once again i'm just putting amazon into this every um any amazon paycheck i get i forgot when we started that but right now we're at one thousand five hundred forty five dollars and forty four cents um i know i have a paycheck coming out this week which only will include sunday um this past sunday um, I didn't go into work Thursday or Friday. Um, I'm trying to see if I can get a little bit of time off as I work through these new medications. And, you know, I'm having to eat less for my stomach. And I don't want to work in a hot warehouse and not be eating. You know what I mean? So, I don't think that's a safe <laughs> thing for me to do. Um, but, yeah. Anyways, we're at $1,545.44. Uh, once we get this other paycheck um, for the 600 my goal for the month of June was to save $600. Uh, so that will, um, I'll meet that. I'm only like $40 off. So with this upcoming paycheck for that Sunday, we should be able to meet my goal for the month of June. All right, so next up is groceries. I gave myself and Jamez a budget of $250.00. Um, I kind of brought you up to here. That was on the uh, May 28th. Excuse me. And then we did Publix. So we were left with $122.76. So if you guys can see, these are more recent. We have $13.06 Publix, $33.21 Publix or Kroger, Publix, Kroger. Now I want to say in... I think the Publix one, this one right here, we did have like $10 worth of dog food stuff. Which one was it? Oh, I think it was this one. I don't know which one it was, but there were $10 worth of dog food stuff in there. But that's okay. So altogether, that's $71.61. So um, we do have $51.15 left remaining. I feel like we'll will be really good with that uh, we still have like three pounds of beef left so the next thing up i'm gonna do is um tacos i bought some shells today i'm um, not shells but tortillas today we already have the cheese i bought that i think back in um during this one right here 
We got different types of cheese. We got Mexican cheese or, or taco blend. Um, we can always do spaghetti again. We, we have noodles. We have the uh, sauce. Um, what else? Um, we still have some chicken thighs left. I think I'm done with the drumsticks. We still have two steaks left. Um, so yeah, I think we're pretty good for the rest of the month. Um, and it's nice to just have some left. I feel like I always like to shop for meats first and get the sides after. I think that really helps me out a lot. Um, but yeah, that's where we're at. How are you guys doing with your finances, with your grocery bill? As I mentioned, this is like the first month of me really just having to budget for groceries uh, since I have exhausted my food stamps that I stopped getting back in November. Once again, I did have a surplus of, you know, saving up the food stamps since November. And as of May, I think towards the end of May, middle of May, I exhausted those. So June was my first month of you know paying out right for groceries i feel okay i was a little bit nervous i'm not gonna lie but i feel like we're doing pretty good um you know meat sales is my thing um i feel like you know buying sides when they're bogle really helps me out a lot and you know just having stuff in my cupboard as well so um, for next month, I am increasing my grocery bill to $300 just so I can stock up on any other things that I may have to stock up on in my cupboards. Uh, so whether that's beans and stuff like that, so that can carry us over a couple months, you know, what they call that, um, stock, not stockpiling, but similar to that. So an extra $50 to cover you know, those type of things, I think that will really be beneficial for me and Jamez um, for sides. And then we can always buy meats to, you know, make meals. Right now, I'm actually doing um, drumsticks and the chicken thighs. Um, and I bought like, um, so we already had like these uh, pre-made seasonings. Um, how do you say it? Like, um, like paint. Is it panko? 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 You know, um, I forgot what you call them, but it's just like um, seasonings. Um, it's not flour, but it's like pink. Yeah, panko. You guys probably know what I'm talking about. But there, there was one that we had. I had bought it on clearance a while back. Uh, like I said, a couple months ago. And that was the Parmesan garlic one. We did that previously. Jamez really liked it with the other drumsticks. So I redid that today. And I went to Lido today. Um, and one thing I did pick up was some spicy, basically pink panko. Um, and yeah, that's what we're doing with the drums, the chicken thighs. And, um, and I think if we're going to do asparagus on the side in the air fryer. So these are all air fryer things. So hopefully it tastes good. Um... I did have, I did try a little piece of pizza yesterday because that's one thing, that's a couple things that I did buy from Kroger as well. Um, some pizza, Jamez made it and he was like, oh, you can have the other half. I'm like, last night I still couldn't eat much, you guys. I had a little bit of that in my, yeah, I didn't feel well. So, uh, yeah, I'm just trying not to eat heavy foods currently. But, uh, yeah, so far, so good. Um, I can't wait to be done with this. <laughs> um, you know, the school loan one, that's going to be a process. But, you know, we're going ahead. I think school loans are going to start picking back up in uh, August. Let me know. How do y'all feel? I know uh, when the new year came around, you know, they asked for, like, your updated information. So, I always like to go based on my income. So last year, because my income was lower, because uh, I was basically part-time for almost the full year, um, my monthly payments are actually zero, but I will continue to use Amazon money for that if I still continue to work at Amazon. So I don't know, you guys. That's up in the air, but once again, I'll fill you guys in on that at a later time because I don't know what's going on, but we'll discuss it. All right. Let me uh, check on this food. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. And let me know how things are going for you. Talk to you soon. Bye.